Breaking news concerning the man convicted on Tuesday of killing a Smith County deputy while driving drunk. A little more than an hour ago, Daniel Nybuda was sentenced by a Smith County jury. And that means KTK is going to hop into the courtroom all day long. He now joins me live in studio to tell us more about this tragic case. Nolan. Neil, a Smith County jury handing down a 32 year sentence in prison for Daniel Nyabuto for intoxicated manslaughter. After nearly four hours of deliberation for a Smith County jury, a verdict in the sentencing of Daniel Nyabuto was reached. Assess punishment and confinement in the institutional division of the Texas Department of Criminal Justice for a period of 32 years. This comes after Nayabuto was guilty of intoxicated manslaughter of a peace officer. The trial went on for eight days before the jury was released on December 15th. They reconvened on January 9th for closing arguments and deliberations. The prosecutors wanted life in prison for Nayabuto. He made a decision to get in the car to turn the key. He made a decision to drive. The defense asking for probation. I don't see giving a guy life in prison saying you deserve the same punishment an intentional killer does. After the verdict was handed down and the courtroom was dismissed, the members of Nayabuto's family were showing plenty of emotion after learning their son's fate. Now, after the judge announced the verdict um, that, that Nayabuto has a period of 30 days to appeal this sentencing. In studio, Nolan Huffman, Okay, All right.